Hi, everybody. My name is Shunji Yamanaka. Uh, first, I would like to say how honored uh, I am to, to be here today. I'm uh, giving a short presentation in one of the world's most famous art, university, art festivals. Uh, well, I'm a design engineer. I designed so many products such as transportation, compact cameras, and the list of chairs, furniture, the electric devices, and the kitchen tours. Fortunately, some of them had gotten gold prize of good design awards in Japan and other countries. And some were selected as a permanent collection of museums, such as the New York MoMA. I wish you might have one or more. <laughs> and my work is not only styling of products, but also engineering, design, and user experience. Well, in fact, if you have a chance to visit Japan, you can see the wireless card ticket gate system almost in every railway station in Japan that I designed 15 years ago. Uh, if you might not feel inconvenient on it, it's my responsibility. And in recent years, I have continually designed and developed the prototypes with scientists and researchers <coughs> based on the achievement of advanced studies. A prototype is not merely an experimental machine. It's a device created to present user experience in advance to share the benefit of technology with many others. Honorably, some interactive robot projects were exhibited in this Arts Electronic Center. A prototype is a physical content that connects the people to technologies that are yet to be socialized. Its roles are not limited to the internal sharing of value within team, but go beyond. It's a medium used to voice the significance of research and development to the society, and inspiration to allow the future market, and also to, to acquire budget for development. In fact, it's a very important thing. So today, I am extremely happy to be here delivering another new project. What I would like to introduce is Hark to Kai. Hark to Kai is a joint development with the Future Robotic Technology Center at the Chiba Institute of Technology. The director of it is the next presenter, Takayuki Furuta. It is a mobility robot equipped with an uh, accurate wheel module of eight legs, uh, each leg with own weight. It is a third generation experimental model of uh, the Harsh Junior project aimed at merging robotics with automotive technology. This transportation robot is 80.5 centimeters long and weighs 20 kilograms and carries seven motors in each leg. Through the code coordinate activation of these 56 motors, Hark can transform into three different modes, a vehicle, insect, and animal mode.
well. Let's start demonstration. Hello, hello, sky. Come on. In bigger mode, Hulk Sukai can pass through that gap of levels with keeping its horizontal balance. Yeah. You can stand ah, close to here. And big. <coughs> and so it combines rotational omnidirectional parallel translation to really move inside the two dimensional space. Yes. Yeah. It can move any directions. Insect mode for walking quickly across uneven train for any it might be too noisy but don't worry the uh, next animal modes eat ah no not yet yeah Yes. This is animal want to quickly walk across narrow road. The body made with aluminum alloy 7075 and carbon fiber. It's designed to emphasize the beauty of structure. Hinting at the future of cybernetic organisms, Arc 2 realized the design that merges me uh, mechanical engineering with aesthetic styling in a complete harmony. Employing robotics to achieve delicate motion, these zero emission vehicle of the future will be able to smoothly enter into your living space and load this nature without having to rely on street, parking lots, and the Adam Foundation. Hark2 is a small but significant experimental model for researching the basic technology required for such future vehicles. Hi, thank you. Good. Good job. Hi. <laughs> okay, enough. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for my presentation. <laughs>